Hello everyone, it's Bobby Gano Who here, I'm welcome to episode 29 of Let's Play Slife War Feast in Time. Yeah, in terms of mountain episodes, this is the longest Sly Cooper game there is. I assume it is, and yeah, I just got a new trophy, it's Hero Tech, which you get the trophy for basically getting rid of any enemy using either Ratchet's Wrench or the next weapon we unlock. I'm not going to reveal it just yet. So yeah, I just got on the first two claws there, so it's time to get all the collectibles in 40 fees. And I already got the first three clue bottles. It's the fourth one, just up here. Well, six, number six, wait, here's number seven. Here we you. Climb up here. Here you two. <laughs> yeah, when you get rid of things with your, your with a ratchet's with ratchet's wrench, you get a bolts. When you destroy things with ratchet's wrench, you get bolts and of coins. Okay, <laughs> first game bunch of clue balls in the process. Okay. That's number 11, I fell in the water. Number 12 should be up here somewhere, here it is. Here we go. And there's a treasure up there as well, we'll get that later. But number 13, it's down here. So far I see that you what it went with a wench. There's number 14. I guess we could pretend Sly Cooper is a Lombax, somehow. Okay. Using his feet costume to get up here. Let's see what's up here. Oh, hey, a mask! So, yeah, I'll get on the mask too. There's mask number 51. Yeah, and. On server, that should not be working. Why I do that? Then get up here to get clue ball number 15. Well, clue, but well, actually, no. If we go down here, there's a little hole here we can crawl into. And it'll actually take us to a secret area. Yeah, this is the only secret area in the entire game here the Lazy Trunk Spa and Lounge. And we need to bring a map up here in order to get the Navigate like Drake one. So if you want to get the trophy, make sure you come to this secret area too. And also there's a mask here. There's a mask here. There's a mask. I sure love repeat myself, don't I? There's a mask. Yeah. Mm. There is a mask there. Yes. I don't know why it's so difficult for me to say that. Yeah. It's also weird if I miss this bell, just relaxing, listen to uh, music. No, I'm actually sleeping. Unfortunately, I can't even get in there unless there's somewhere to glitch through there, but I don't think there is. Okay, so that's a secret area. Now let's do back to on to the clue balls. And I think there's one over here. Yes, okay, yes, there is. Number 16, get back to your home. Number 17. Should be up here. Get over to here, and there's another clue ball over way over here. Okay. For number 18, it's right. Oh, it's right by here, next to these stepping stones, I guess. And for number 19, it's on top of this rope here. Okay. There we go. For number 20. It's wide up there on the archway. Number 21. It's on there. And number 22. Gotta climb all the way up here. No, I don't think this is clue. I think this is where we're gonna get the next mask. I think anyway. Hey, there's a treasure here too, so go and have that for later. And yeah, we swing down here. 
That's where Klubo is, and if you miss it, just jump all the way back up here and you should get it. Damn it, how do I get out to that clue bowl? Well, if we power glide down here, there's another mask down here. There you go, that's 54 now. <laughs> okay. Well, the next clue bowl should be on one of these bouncy carpets here. Yes, we can now stand down onto enemies using the, a power glider. This is kind of cool, but I barely use it. We'll go down here and jump down here, and that's how you get that clue ball. Okay, for number 25, it's over here. Only five left to go. I think number 26 shouldn't be too far off, according to my radar. Yeah, it's right up on that bouncy trampoline. For number 27, it's. Should be near here, yes so we. Okay, and for number 28, should be somewhere around here. Nah, I think it's up here. Like way up here. There it is. And number 29 is right down here. Okay, and for the last clue bottle, it's over there. So there you go, that's all the clue balls gone. Let's head to the safe, which thankfully is right next to the hideout here, so I guess they got so it's like, nah, he's safe here, I don't care. So let's see what we get. Ooh, these jars got controls. I prefer to have prefer the cold way. And we got the Guru Star piece. How did this Noonstone get in the ball? How did it get... Travel back in... Uh... Uh, yeah. Okay, now it's time to get one more mask. Just gonna jump your way over to here. And we got these bouncy things. Now bounce way all the way up here to this giant gate here and I failed to do so right there but yeah there's a mass on on top of this thing on top of this gigantic archway here so make sure the ninja spell jumps and your ninja spell jumps right and there we go I only got five masks left to go <sighs> uh. Okay, now that we're done with all that, I think it's time to start with the treasures. And I think there's one more of a mask right by the next iron as well, if I remember. Yeah. Eh. Okay. Didn't get bullseye, but you know, I don't care. Yeah, I can't wait to open the costume gate, really. But if you go behind here. Yep, there's another mask there. But there's only four more left. Two in the arcade cabinets and two more in the last mission of the entire game, so. Let's start getting the uh, treasures. There's treasure number one over there, like I said. Treasure number two is a lamp, but it's right by the corner of that building there. Or treasure number three. It's right over by the island where we. Gotta use the archery costume yet again. Uh, sure off losing the archery one now, and it's a thief costume gate. Okay. Just gonna balance on here. Here we go. No idea what that is, but I'm taking it. It's like a, it's like a plat, flat piece of gold, which I don't mind. Okay, next treasure, it's inside here. Yeah, we've seen this before, it's a, it's a fancy little pillow there. Sure, I'll take it. Okay, next treasure, we've seen this already, it's all the way up here. Yeah, sure got Soline here, but then again, we'll be able to pale. No, I can't pale glide. What is. Uh, whatever. 
There's a golden bottle up there, so there we go. Weep! Okay. For the next treasure, it's right over here. And it's a jailbird costume gate, so. Yeah. And we also got us. Do a saber two pounce here while we're boring the lasers, though. Timing. Come on. You know what this will do? There we go. The heck is, the heck is that thing? The, what the, what the? So yeah, and it's right behind the laser trunk spa. Which you're wondering. So come on. Okay, and this way I can cheese it with the thief costume. Our next treasure is up here by that. These weird looking goats. Thank you, I'll take that. Uh, okay, next treasure. It's right in. It's in this sort of archway here. And it's a saber tooth costume gate, so yay. Okay. That scroll? I think it's a scroll win. Yeah. Next treasure is. It's. Well. Is it by here? No, it's not by here. We gotta climb this rope to get to this part of our world, and yeah, there's another jailbird costume gate. Okay. Get rid of the lasers. Swing across this hook. And it's a sand white costume gate. Okay. There we go. <laughs> we got a little treasure chest here. How much was simpler can you get? Now be careful here when you bring this treasure chest back, because for some reason you can't swing across hooks while you're in the feed costume. I have no idea why, but yeah, be careful with that. Okay, for the next treasure, it's on top of here, just make a wall hook up here. Screw you, Sir Gallif, and yep, take it back to the hideout. Now, here is a painting of Miss Decibel for some reason, and it's, and it's behind that archway there, so yeah. And there's a sword on top of that Lee Paradox parachute there, I guess. Okay, and that's all the treasures in Nation of Arabia. Call of Quantia. You get it for unlocking all the arcade cabinets in the game, which you need to collect all the treasures to do that. So yeah, we got on every treasure in the game. So let's do the, the fifth. Yeah, the fifth arcade cabinet, System Cracker Extreme! Yeah, so I will speed this up because we're kind of limited for time here as well. So I apologize if I speed this up again, like, like all the way back in Rabbits 1 and 2. Oh, yeah. Also, Jesus, a lot of propellers here. Just be very careful and be very patient. So yeah, destroy all the as you can, and yeah, it should be, should be too hard to get a high score here. And there's lasers now. It's on positive side, the loading screens aren't that long. And yeah, the tank is back. Avoid yeah. since it's slow, it's, it's even more harder to avoid this propeller, so be careful. Weird this crap. Come on. Here we go.
Hey. Get away you. There we go. Okay, and here you go. Psst. When you're here, you should go to your left and destroy the wall to your left there. there there's the mask there. I'll get at the end of this episode, but yeah. The mask is here to my to the behind the left wall, so remember that. I didn't know so cool, so I'll go back and get later, like I said. So I guess all I can do is just focus on the high score. Beep 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 Ah. Okay. But I'm believing not we're only halfway through. Yeah, even at at faster speed it still goes on for uh, actually no we're not we're, we're not even halfway there. I mean we're nearly halfway there, but we're not yet, so yeah, this goes on forever. Commencing hack. Okay. Now we got the ricochet shots now. Once again, gotta be very careful. Gotta do a charge around it again. Come on. There we go. Also get all those blue hues there for extra points. Yay! And yeah, you got to, you got to do the charge. Rod red whirlpools disappear, reappear, and all that. Very annoying. Okay. Now you got a whole square then to deal with. Okay. Or you know, you can do it like that. Yeah, this really is starting to get complex now. Jesus. You can't grab a dickie unless you're green because we're racist or colorist. Yeesh. Okay, we're three quarters away then now, so. Don't worry, we're at the end. I, I need the tank though, so. There we go. Blasting through everything in sight. Okay, be careful of the lasers of course. Make sure I got everything. Let's move on. Back to the green ship. Gotta get rid of all the enemies here. Bring it on! Bring it on! Oh, yeah, now we need a ricochet shot, which we need to do this. Oh, that will work, I need to... There we go. And all you will do is two with the lasers and they we disappear and reappear. That's great. That's just fantastic. Okay, believe it or not, I think we're at the end now. <laughs> I gotta get rid of these. His ricochet shot. There we go. Here we go. We got a bunch more enemies to take care of. And it's that blue purple red flea again, which I don't know how to take care of, so. I'm at a dead end now. Seriously, I try everything. Trying to use all three shits, use the charge bit. There's a tank, nothing works. I really have no idea. Does, I mean, does it have a weak spot or something? Because it's not taking any hits, yeah, so. Yeah, Kima 7, yeah. I got. My score is much bigger than Bentley's here. Wow. So, yeah, we, we shouldn't be that difficult to get the highest score on this arcade cabinet. We shouldn't be. There you go, let's. That's all five arcade cabinets and all five episodes done. Now there is a sixth arcade cabinet I still gotta do, but and of course it's in the Paris State House, which I showed you once we started backtracking. So 
Gotta take care of that next episode, but for now... Let's head back to the Paris hideout and... Yeah, I'll do the 6 arcade cabinet in the next episode, but... I think it's now time to show off all the treasures from Asian Arabia and... Yeah, 101 ways to cook scorpion. Ugh. Well, like, we can't imagine myself eating scorpion. That sounds disgusting. A marble horse hat. Head. Why did I say hat? Gold cobra. A good old Arabian carpet. <laughs> oh, John has one because he's now a carpet seller or something like that. A chilled pillow. Diamonds, ruby, and the pearls. My diamond! Your diamond! Ruby and. Huh. The narcissist has a patent of himself. What a narcissistic asshole. Okay, and your classic treasure chest. Okay, the classic magic lamp, of course. Oh, even Miss Desabelle has a painting of herself. <sighs> yeah. A jewel encrusted silver scimitar, I think. Just call it a sword, that's what it is, a sword. Okay, see all these before. Mark Shots calling. Puffins cooking cookie jar. It's like who'd been in the game store cookie shop once as part of the first heist. Bright game polish. Oh my. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay. Okay, no, that's from the medieval in England. Okay, prehistoric stuff. Uh, Western stuff again. Medieval stuff. Is that it? I think that's everything. Yep. Look at this, all the treasures. Yeah, all the treasures. Complete sh shelf of treasures. So, next time on Let's Play Sly for Peace and Time, which I'll take down the 6 arcade cabinet here. And, well, We'll be finishing off the game, so it's more gonna who, and I'll see you next time. Late people.